tutorial, we're going to show you how to create magic. Ready? Here comes the magic. And there's the magic. I know, so magical. So I'm going to show you how to uh, make that curve and hook it up to the visual editor to spell out the word magic. All right, so you see in the background is a 2D sprite I'm using as a guide um, to so I can sketch out the path. I uh, just wrote that out myself and took a photograph of it and imported it as a texture. Um, I put, like to put it in 2D mode as well. That makes uh, sketching out a 2D object a little easier. So first thing, we're going to create a path, a lean tween path. And you go to create, create other through that drop down. Um, so we have a uh, simple path already, um, just two nodes. Uh, so I'm going to start getting that into place. all those into place. You can either click in the hierarchy window or in the actual screen scene itself. Um, so you see the blue points are the places it passed through and the white ones are the they affect how much the curvature is. Um, if you've ever worked with a Bezier tool, it uh, they mostly all function the same. Um, so I made this new button so you can easily append um, points. So this makes sketching out a path like this very easy. Uh, you can just keep appending, appending, appending. That's how I made up this whole magic word. Um, and it can kind of it kind of continues the uh, direction it was going in already, so that also simplifies it. Um, so you can start to see the path is forming and grounding that curve. Um, you can also delete node points pretty easily. You just click on the blue point you want to delete and hit delete. Um, sometimes the less nodes, the uh, nicer the, um, the curve is. You don't have any jagged points um, in your curve. So you get the idea. We're, we're making uh, starting that M off. Um, and once you get going, it's pretty easy to, uh, it was pretty easy for me to finish that off. Um, but I want to get to the point of hooking up this path. Um, to do so, let's. Uh, this is the particle we want to animate. I'm going to create a uh, add a component, the lean tween visual component. Um, just start a group, and I want to do a, a tween. A, I want to do a move tween, move it along a Bezier path, and it needs to know what path you want to move it upon. So I just hook that up. And time of one is fine. I'm going to do some easing, easing courtship. Uh, so now it's hooked up. Um, I'll, let's see it in action. There it is. So you can get the idea. Also animating the wand with the visual editor, and you can pretty much do any uh, lean tween method with the visual editor. It's pretty powerful. Um, and I hope you enjoy the new lean tween path editor. Oh, uh, here's a little more detail of the, the path that was created. You can uh, delete nodes within here. You can delete all. There's even a uh, easy path creator where you can make uh, rounded rectangle, rectangles. That's a handy one. Um, circle, uh, 
some other handy tools. And you can also append nodes in this view as well. Um, you can also export this uh, created path if you want to um, hook up the path in that way. And uh, you can import a created path. You know, say you created it in an old project and you want to uh, uh, copy it into a, a new scene but keep the, the same path. That's a handy way to do that. All right, so that is now really it for the uh, path editor. I hope you enjoyed the video.